For the team of scientists, Ida's fossilised remains are much more than just a frozen moment in time. She's opened a window into the world of 47 million years ago. A time known as the Eocene. The world was very different from today. There were no polar ice caps. Deep sea ocean currents weren't flowing. The continents were drifting. All factors that produced a much warmer climate than today. The Earth was experiencing its greatest increase in average temperature ever known, resulting in a jungle world, lush, warm and wet. Rainforests covered most of the globe. The Eocene period is really the critical stage for a mammal evolution. It's when all the old timers, they are still around and the newcomers are coming strongly into the field. And of course the primates, they are thriving. There's so many different ones in the Eocene. Eda typifies that primate evolution. Even though she lived her life millions of years ago, she shares many characteristics with modern primates. She was small and agile. Her body was perfectly adapted for life in the jungle. She would have looked like many of the lemurs and primitive monkeys of today. Her teeth even show similarities to humans. In many ways, she appears to display the blueprint of primate anatomy. Oh, it, it, it's a discovery of great significance. We desperately want to know where we came from. Um, and this, is, uh, this little creature is going to show us our connection with the rest of, of all the mammals. But this is as near as we're likely ever to get. You not only have the bones, but you have the fur. You have the flesh. And it's not a question of deduction, not a question of imagination, not a question of suggestions. It's fact. There it is. There is the stomach, and there are the contents of the stomach, and that was Eda's last meal. And now people can say, OK, you say we're, we're, we're primates, like monkeys and apes, uh, and that we came from very uh, simple, generalised uh, mammals. Show us the link. The link, they would have said, until now, is missing. Uh, well, it is no longer missing. It'll be interesting to see uh, what those who have been working in these fields for all their careers uh, will make of this new uh, sudden uh, revelation. Uh, for some, it will no doubt confirm what they suspected. Uh, and there may be some, I don't know, but there may be some who will have a nasty surprise uh, to discover that this is the way it went and not that way, which is what they might have thought until now. We'd have to wait and see.